is that that's really the best you can do, is it? This is the new merchandise. Well, hello and welcome to Glen ZB TV, the show that puts Glen ZB into your TV. And this morning, because we ran out of time yesterday, I know you've been asking, what really happened uh, to this week's Glen ZB TV episodes? Uh, if you're a regular follower of Glen ZB uh, TV, you'll know that you haven't been able to be a regular follower of Glen ZB TV this week. And I can finally reveal what really happened. What really happened is, we thought it would be cool to have some lost episodes. Like Doctor Who. You know, all those other cool programs where there's just some episodes that they know are out there, but that, that people think that they've seen, and then it sort of creates a bit of a, a like an urban myth about them. Don't you think that would be cool? So we thought that would be cool. So we made some episodes, and we lost them deliberately. That's our story, and I'm sticking to it. Texting and driving again. I know it's been a week of it, but I just love it. And yesterday I couldn't resist because I saw, I saw that. There's a, it's a car. <laughs> Can you believe it? There's a yellow sign hanging in the window of the car. <laughs> it says, it says this is a stupid yellow sign. Ha! That's gold. I can't really explain to you how difficult it is to Paxton drive a car that's driving beside you on the motorway at about 100 k's an hour. Very technically difficult. All right, we've got um, more into inter office emails for you. Oh, there, here we go. Not into email office, but into office emails. <clears throat> uh, studio chair from Studio 8. If you have removed the studio chair from the studio, please return it ASAP. The studio is used regularly, and people need this chair to sit on. They're right. This whole missing chair thing is... It's got out of control. People need chairs. Damn it. Feedback Friday. Oh man, those hemis are really burning now. Oh, lights up. Talking about this, up, reach, up, squatting power, average. Uh, Julia wrote, here's some feedback about your feedback. Yay, I heard my name on your show. I feel so special. There you go, doubly special today. What have we got here? Oh, that's right. I, I tweeted earlier in the week that I, that I bought a, a pair of Crocs last weekend. I know. I don't know what happened. You know, sometimes you go away and you do crazy stuff. It's really, really sweating now. This is a good workout. My, my personal trainer is going to be so pleased. Anyway, um, so yeah, put a pair of, pair of Crocs. And th there are crazier things that you can do when you go away for the weekend, but that's, pretty, that's right up there. So a lot of response. Perhaps the biggest response to anything that I've ever tweeted to this. I'm not kidding. Uh, producer Mella, a, a woman I work with every day who is away at the moment getting married. She says, I leave for one day and this happens. Lorna, come back Emily, she means producer Mella. It'll be stubbies next. People are very worried about the crop situation. Craig, uh, compulsory wear in most campgrounds. Now you're a seasoned camper. He's right, you know, I went camping for the first time ever this year. Does that make me seasoned? It's starting to shake, it's starting to shake. Can I make it? I've got about 45 seconds to go. I'm, I'm pretty sure I can hang in there. Come on, come on, Glenn. You can do it. Uh, Vivian, good for you, Glenn. Nothing like a pair of rubber shoes on a hot day. So, that's a bit of a weird one, that one. Uh, things are starting to get weird. Or so I thought. Serena, was it male and female croc? Are you allowed those as pets here? Yeah, you've taken it too far, Serena, basically. They were just crocs. They don't really look like crocs in my defense. They've sort of got Leather, leather on the, I'm not really saving myself here at all, am I? Anyway, I'm starting to cramp up, so we're going to bring this to an end. I am Glenn ZB. Thank you so much for having me and your telly. Ah.